hey guys, today I'm going to review you the best satisfying fidget toy ever. Which will be the two toys that I love. I love... Sorry. If your stress is triple dipple, then I guess that you're gonna have to put off all those layers with this triple triple simple dimple and and it's actually the best fidget ever. <sighs> no. The best fidget. I know one of the part doesn't look very good, but because it's broken, but don't worry about that. You have other parts to fidget with. This one is so satisfying. It has soft silicone and even the stretchy rope to hang on. You could squeeze this silicone ball. And guess what? Those three silicone balls are also irresistible enough. And I'm gonna show you a little code. Look, you just slide this one in the middle. Put the last one down and put the first one up. This is the little code that I like. <laughs> it also has a real switch on it. Very nice, right? It has so many parts, I cannot show you that. I'm gonna show you the next part now, okay? I, I mean, tomorrow, I guess, or later, okay? So. Look, this is the squishy, squishy octopus. It's so squishy, you can Splash it, splash it. But be careful. But be careful. If your nails are sharp, sharp, I mean, remember to tell your mom to cut them if you think they are too long. Because you might accidentally break this ball if you could actually put your nails in them. But if you put your nails on it gently, then it won't pop. If you put it hard, then it might pop. So, please try not to pop it because all your because your toy will be ruined. And so be careful. And if one pops, then that means that it's time to get a new one for you. And remember kids, stay safe with your toys, okay? Plus, you know what? I'm going to tell you a story about my mom agreeing to the homemade toy called Mommy Longlegs. You know, it was rejected.
because all of the kids had nightmares because of this and and so that's why I decided to make my mom make this at home and And if you watched that